Hey guys, I'm pretty excited to be here at MAC Museum of Art and Culture in Lake Macquarie to do the first workshop today of Yarns Parry Stories on Country. Uh, the original artwork's been donated by Transport New South Wales to the Yipung Aboriginal Art Space here at the museum and uh, this artwork really picks up the footprint that uh, transport were considering when bringing a bypass for freight trains into Newcastle. We have Lake Macquarie here and we also have the Hexham wetlands. So the key and the legend that you see is picking up those special places, those Dreamtime stories, initiation sites, the dock hole, a whole range of different symbolism used. There's the inter interactive felt board here that's available also for kids and uh, community to learn a little bit more about Aboriginal art and symbolism. Aboriginal people had a spoken language but also symbolic language and the key for the symbols used within the artwork is right here alongside some of the felts and imagery that can be uh, yeah, used to learn a little bit more about our local culture. So we're all set up ready for our workshop and uh, a part of this exhibition is also showing you the journey because it was a very collaborative journey with Professor John Maynard, uh, Ray Kelly Jr and the team to record that journey forward with Knowledge Keepers to explore research and uh, bring the information together. Over here there's a tablet which people can jump onto the transport website and this is an interactive story map that people can go in to hear the verbal or the audio stories and uh, see the video clips of the collaboration along the way and also see and explore some of the some of those special sites on country. This is a takeaway for those who are coming along to the exhibition and um, also the the stories the research and sh the, the extended stories so that um, you know those who are interested can have a little look at those full stories on country of some of the most significant sites across this land